Hello, my name is Obi and welcome to today's show. We are going to be talking to a few business consultants, organizations, companies, and government officials about what it really takes for local businesses, small and medium, to take their business globally. A lot of businesses don't know how to do that, but today we have a few tips for you, so stay tuned. Um, today's event is about a forum that we have organized uh, entitled uh, The World of Global Business. And uh, this is forum is uh, geared towards uh, promoting U.S. exports and supporting the advocacy of uh, the U.S. Department of Commerce under the International Trade Administration. A lot of business owners get discouraged thinking their business does not have what it takes to go global. But nonprofit organizations such as CTIP, their main focus is to work with businesses to position themselves in the global market. It is important for small businesses to be given the right information, the most correct and up-to-date information about doing business um, uh, globally, about global compliance to make sure that they are legally and, 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 and protected and um, that they have access to finance where available. And also it's important for them to understand that as a small business, it's very, very logical that um, they pursue business opportunities abroad, either through e-commerce or through basically um, finding partners um, in their field that might be very, very amenable to doing business with a small firm here in the United States. Uh, you know, today's event with CTIP, the Council for Trade and, and, and Investment Promotion, uh, I think is important because I think it's all about networking, you know. Uh, many people have a service, many people have a product, um, and a lot of times they're successful locally, but the, the, the goal is to figure out how to grow um, out of that small circle, right? How can I take my product uh, to a larger platform? How can I get, get it out to the masses? Uh, I think a lot of times many of us are smart and we work hard but I think sometimes we just need the right doors to be open for us. Open doors is exactly what CTIP is about. Helping businesses grow globally while attracting investment to a country, state, region, or city. For us, at the, at the Mayor's Office of International Relations and Diaspora Affairs, there's no qualification. The only qualification is to be for your business to be resident or domiciled in the city of Newark. So once a business is uh, domiciled in the, in the city of New York, either the business or the owner, it doesn't really matter. If the owner is domiciled and uh, 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 resides in New York, but the business is domiciled in Irvington or somewhere I don't know, around, around New York, we'll still assist you. But we prefer that the business is situated, located in the city of New York, so that, because that's where you're going to create jobs for our residents. Here are a few tried and true tips for business owners. First is focused and undertake continuing education, update himself of the trend, you know. So this is one way of, uh, of uh, trying to overcome issues or problems that he may encounter overseas, you know. Attend forums like this, you know, where they share visions, interests, ideas, and, and all that. Every local community college, as an example, has uh, continuing ed education. You can do a collective of it through your small business consortiums, through your elected officials. You establish with them through conversation. We voted for you, we put you in office, and these are our needs. And let them, with your assistance, develop these opportunities at these local institutions who have the facilities, who can bring in the chamber and the state and whomever else and sit down and lay out what your concerns are about your business growth. A city has community development, economic development, but if it's not working for you, then it's broken. For more information about CTIP, visit their website at ctip.info. If there's anyone in your community making a positive impact and would like to be highlighted on this show, email us at info at ob1productions.com. The show has been brought to you in part by KissPix, where photography is innovative, creative, and unexpected.